Greetings Earthlings, it's Saturday 12th of August, it's 10.30am, just been dropped off at the little village of Lanvethrin by my sister and I'm doing two days around the Three Castles Walk in South Wales in the UK. Um, it's one and a half miles to the first castle which is White Castle, two days of food. Seeing if my foot's all right. Getting spied on by a few sheep here. So I'm just doing a little two-day test hike, just to mostly to make sure my foot's okay, because uh, I'll be hiking uh, the second half of the coast to coast. This isn't too windy for you uh, at the end of the month, so I just want to make sure my foot's right. I'll make sure all my gears working okay. So. Just a little try out two days, oh, one overnighter, should be good, bit of rain forecast, oh the sheep are going wild, alright let's see what happens. Okay, I've already gone a mile and I'm lost. <laughs> the, bridge, the bridge was down on the footpath and now I'm lost in these fields. But I don't really care. I'm out and about. It's a little bit of cool drizzle. Ah, oh, it's good. Everything's good. Well, that was White Castle. I haven't been there since I was a kid, and uh, it's really good, really good, isn't it? Um, I was gonna do a talky bit in there, but it was an invasion of kids. <laughs> it was mental. It was like a medieval battle in there, kids everywhere. Nice though, really good, great. Um, so the uh, three castles are White Castle, Skenfrith, and Grosmont Castle, like a, <coughs> a chain 
castles on the Wales England border. We'll be seeing the border up the River Mono in a bit, probably tomorrow. <coughs> um, I think they're all sort of built around about the 1200s by the Normans, keep us Welsh in line. Um, and they've all sort of over like 100 to 200 years from the 1200s, they turned from wooden mud and dirt into um, the huge stone things that you see. There's loads, I'm just walking down this lane, there's loads of little. Just down from White Castle, there's loads of little places out in the woods here that are obviously um, Airbnb type things. Pretty good, cool. Um, so the next target now is Skemfrith Castle and I'll probably stay the night somewhere in a field or the woods around there somewhere. Let's just get through the style. Nice little bridge coming up here. Um, I've never walked all of this route. It's only about um, 30 miles I think. Might even be 30k. Uh, but I'm just going to take it easy, enjoy myself. Make sure my injuries are right. Make sure my gear's working properly. Where do we go now? Um, so far it's been good. I've enjoyed it. Well, I'm only two miles in. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going now. I'm going to put the camera away. Get some film from you. Put some mystical, wistful music on for you. Oh, it'll be great. It's everything's so green. It's been raining so hard in the past week here, and uh, everything's really green. All right. Let's get to it. Greetings, Earthlings. <clears throat> I headed to a spot called Traveller's Seat, thinking there would be somewhere to sit there. And of course there wasn't. <laughs> well, the next stretch is a bit of road. So I've just jumped off the road, I'm in the woods. And I'm just having uh, some lunch. Nice in here. I'll give you a little view. Somebody's got a year over there. Yurts and cabins everywhere now. Been a really good trail so far. Um, if you're thinking Hobbiton to the Prancing Pony through the Shire, then that's the kind of trail it is. Really nice, really enjoyed it. Those are wildflowers, birds, bees, it's great. So I'm just having a bit of food now. Cheesy snacks and some dried sausage. Not sure how far I am from um, Skemfrith, but it's not too far. Um, hopefully, I'll have a pint there in the pub. Maybe a swim. Mm, that might be quite nice. Alright, gonna have some food and get back to it.
All right, I have booked into the caravan site at Skenforth. <laughs> I'm in the caravan site. Caravans are just me in my little Durston tent in one of the pictures. I thought I'd better camp here rather than out in the woods in case I need to be rescued in the morning. It's easy to get, get my sister to come here and get me if my foot's sore, so. <clears throat> Pretty achy, but it doesn't feel injured. But I was just a little bit worried. I didn't really want to get stranded if it's like I wake up in the morning, it's like a balloon or something. So there we are. Tent set up. <clears throat> it's about 4 pm. I'm gonna go to the pub, have a pint, come back, hang out at the tent. Greetings Earthlings, it's the next day, I woke up in my tent, the rain was coming down, very relaxing so I had another hour of sleep, but unfortunately my foot and my lower right leg aren't quite right still, um, so I'm going to call it a day, I'm going to call this White Castle to Lambethrin, <laughs> uh, I just don't want to push it and make it worse, but I've had a good day's hike, it's a good night out in the tent, had a pint in the bell. Yeah, pretty good, so I'm not discouraged in any way. Do a bit of physio, do a bit of training, let's see how things shape up for the coast to coast. If I can't go, I can't go. Uh, I'll give Jeremy a ring tonight. But, you know, I'm on the mend. At least I got a day's hike in and... Yeah, all right. Hope you enjoyed the scenery. Sorry I didn't take you around all three castles, but I was gonna be there. They've been there for hundreds of years already, so... Alright. <laughs>